Hello and welcome. In this short video, we want to show you a hopefully quick, quicker and better way to upload files as attachments to SAP Business One from your local drive or computer. As you know, in SAP Business One, whenever you see a tab with the name attachments, it means that you can attach files to the document you're working with. The most traditional way of doing that is through this button called Browse, which actually lets you browse the contents of your server and also your remote share, in this case, your local drive or computer. If you are connecting to SAP Business One through RDP, this process can take longer than you wish for because actually the RDP needs to list all the directories on your remote share, in this case, your computer or local drive. So today we want to show you a quicker way of doing that. Um, in this case, we are going to attach a file that it's located in our local drive to a sales order in SAP Business One. So once you are ready to attach your file, instead of clicking browse and going through that process, what you're going to do is you're going to go to your file explorer icon. So you need to have your Windows icon bar visible while working on SAP Business One for this process to work fast and smooth. Once you, you go to your file explorer, you're just going to locate your file. So in this case, my file, the file that I want to attach to SAP, it's, it's here. I found it already. It's in my local drive. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hover over it or select it, and then I'm going to right click on my mouse and I'm going to copy it. Once I've copied this uh, file, I come back to SAP Business One. I now click on Browse, select Browse right underneath it. And this will open this additional window that lets me explore the different drives where I can put this file into. So for those of you whose system is hosted with Consensus Preferred Hosting Provider slash Consulting, if you go to this PC and you scroll to the bottom of the options in this drive, you're going to find this personal folder drive that it's been created for you for this specific purpose. So once you open this personal folder G, you will see by default you have a folder name data transfer workbench. You can create additional folders if you want to organize your attachments or documents. In this case, I'm going to call this folder my attachments. And then once you open the folder in which you want to save this uh, attachment, you just need to click anywhere here in the white space and select paste. And here we have the document that we wanted to attach, the file. So now we just click on open. And the file is already attached to the document in SAP Business One that we wanted to, to have it in without having to browse through all the directories. So we hope this tip is helpful for you. If your system is not hosted with our preferred uh, hosting providers, Last Consulting, or your system is deployed on premise on your own service on your own server please talk to your IT services provider or your hosting provider so that they can also create a folder like this for you or shorten the path uh, for the attachments in SAP Business One so that uh, you can have a nice experience with attachments. Thank you very much for listening and please don't hesitate to contact us if you have any questions with this process or any other. Call us or write us an email. We are here for you. Thank you very much. Have a wonderful day.